This is our Tire Watcher X2 version uh, 3, so just off covering what you actually get in the kit. You get a manual. Um, it's best to always check the online version of this or our videos as printed versions go out of date pretty quick because we can update the like, software on the actual device. This little bag contains all the little bits you need. So you've got like a stick pad here, so this is like a reusable stick pad. You just stick this on the dash and like the unit will just like stick on top of it. And you can actually peel it off and reuse it. You can chop it down if you don't want it like overhanging or like whatnot. So that's what you use to mount the unit on the dash. You have like a VHB 3M stick pad here. This is how you mount the unit onto the windscreen. In here you have your lock nut, so this is what you spin on first. And then screw the sensors on to stop theft and spare gaskets. Which are just like the seals in the actual sensor here. Which we'll sh I can show you later on. A spanner. I have to change the batteries or change the seal. And to screw on like the lock nuts. The charge cable. Depending on how many like, sensors you've got in the actual kit, it'll uh, tell you how many you've got. So like this kit, it's a, a 12 sensor kit, and there's like a mixture of small and large sensors. So like, the difference is the larger sensors are going to give you better range. So like, normally the larger sensors will be used in the caravan or the trailer, and the smaller sensors will be, will be used on the car. You can see the size difference there. And then if you still have issues with like range issues, which you'll you'll be able to tell on the display, then we just need to install a repeater, which is just a black box that you can normally put on the A-frame of the caravan. So those are your external sensors. You have the actual screen itself. So a solar panel on the back, three buttons on the top, charging port, and the mounting frame, which just clips in like this, and then you can change the angle as you need, and obviously that can be like mounted on the windscreen upside down, which will be around this way. All mounted on your dash should be around this way and that's everything that you're going to get in a kit so the only extra options we have is we do have internal sensors so those are our sensors that are placed inside your tire and repeaters for the system